you fan Sally teaches you to the video. Welcome to the video. How's everyone doing today? Hope you guys are all doing fantastic. I'm here today with a new haul video, which I'm very excited about because I haven't really done a haul video in a hot second, especially one from the thrift. So if you guys watched my previous video from about two days ago, I'm going to have it linked right up there and down below in the description box as well. Um, I did a store tour of the re-grand opening of uh, one of the last stores that are reopening in Orange County uh, after the quarantine. Um, and I'm... Uh, definitely they're taking all the precautions in the stores. Um, I actually I'm still not actually going thrifting right now And I only went because uh, I was gonna be one of the only people there and I was gonna be able to tour the store and take a look because I miss the stores so much And I was lucky enough to have one of my friends um, who actually was gonna go to the store the next day So I was like if you see some of these items, please pick them up for me if they're still there and uh, Luckily enough, uh, they were able to grab a couple of the pieces for me. So let me show you guys what I got, and I also, uh, when I went to pick up the items for my friend, I also ended up going to the potting shed. So if you can see right behind me, I'm so excited to introduce to you guys my brand new Monstera Deliciosa, and this is the large for Monstera. So the leaves, when this becomes a more mature plant, are going to be massive. They could probably be like this big, like... It's gonna be amazing. I'm really excited to see it in its like full glory. So give it a few years and it's gonna be amazing. It's already huge right now. Uh, unfortunately, some of the leaves were damaged. Um, and that's even before I even purchased the plant. That's just from transportation and all that. But I'm just gonna cut them away. And these plants, usually they grow pretty fast, especially around this time. So I'm really excited. I'm actually gonna put it um, in an outside area. It is still gonna be covered. And I am super duper excited about that. And then the next thing is also a really large thing. Okay, I'm gonna try and hold this up so you guys can see. But this is a carpet. It is an outdoor carpet. Um, it's Target brand, sorry. I'll show you guys how it looks on the floor in a little bit. But um, that, I have been searching high and low for that carpet for so long and I regret not buying it before when it was uh, when I thought it was more expensive because now I can't even go to thrift stores so um, this was a little bit of uh, this was a little pricey at $80 but it is I think it's an 8 by 10 size carpet so it is a, a really great size it's an outdoor carpet I'm actually gonna be putting it outside right here that's why it's so windy I <laughs> have like the door open and the breeze is so nice um, and I'm actually gonna put this over there and I have just been dreaming about this piece in that space for so long and I can't wait to show you guys the transformation because I'm gonna be giving that area a little bit of a makeover with the items that are actually in this video so if you guys want to see that video don't forget to subscribe hit the little bell button so you're notified because I am within the next few days after this video goes up that video will go up as well and uh, I'm really excited to show you guys the transformation of my little patio area with all of my new plants and thrifted items so um, those are the first two things. Then, the next thing that I got here, uh, this is a really beautiful fuchsia plant. I think only like a couple of the flowers are open, but there's a couple right there. Really pretty. Uh, I've never, I don't think I've really seen one in this color combo, which is why I picked it up. It's so fun. Mom's wanted a fuchsia for a while, and every time I see them at like, um, other like at, like Lowe's and Home Depot they look a little beat up and this one was in beautiful condition they had lots of different colors but this one just resonated with me I really liked the color combination they had like other more bright pinky magenta-y and uh, purple colors but this one was just I just thought it was really really pretty so uh, got this guy and I'm super duper excited for it. I love flowering plants um, I normally can't keep them alive that well. That is mom's thing. So luckily she's really good with that. I'm more of like the house planty one, like that guy back there. So I'm really excited about this plant. I think it's gorgeous. And again, the color is so super duper cool. Um, then up next, I believe this is an African violet. And I also got this for mom. She loves African violets. And I've never seen African violets with variegated leaves. The leaves on this are stunning. And the 
purple color of the flowers are so pretty and I was so excited that I found these and mom really really likes it and the leaves are just so cool I don't know if you guys have ever seen or felt um, the leaves on African violets they're like kind of fuzzy it's really awesome and again just having the variegated leaves the white and the green I thought was really super cool and I've never seen African violets like this so I had to pick it up. Comment down below if you've ever seen African violets like this because I have like never seen them like this and I think it's just so cool. Um, look at that leaf. Like it's like a work of art. It has like the three different colors. It has like the white, it has a darker green and then it has the lighter green as well. So it's kind of like three. So awesome. And I just watered this last night and it's like the bottom's a little bit drippy. I'm like dripping on my on the floor. Um, but yeah, okay, so there's that. Really excited. So cool. And then another plant that I have is this one. And this one is just so stunning. The colors are spectacular. Like the veining in the inside, like it's like a magenta red and it like radiates outwards and then it has like a like a light pink polka dot and then it has the green of the rest of the leaf it's just so beautiful i am so excited um uh, i actually don't know what type of plant this is um so if you know what it is comment down below i i have to you know that app where you can like take a photo of your plant and it'll tell you what it is i need to do that to this one but comment down below i know a lot of you guys are plant enthusiasts out there and I can never remember any of the plant names. I'm literally, literally one of the worst. So, I'm um, very excited about this. I'm gonna put this back here. And look how pretty that is. Ah, I love it. I just wanna be surrounded by plants. That's l such a dream. Okay, then last but not least, I have to be careful because there's some water that dripped from the plants into here, but check it out. Okay, so I don't know if, um, I, there, I had a vlog where I went to Target for the first time during quarantine um, and I was picking some stuff up and I was looking at the home goods section and I actually saw this planter it's a three-tier planter um, metal and then it's supposed to have these white ceramic uh, planter bowl things um, this was at the Goodwill and it's missing the planters I'm pretty sure maybe like the planters like the pots broke or something or um, whatever and they only have this but this is actually so perfect it's so awesome I'm actually I think I'm gonna be like I think I'm gonna just keep this outside and it's great because if the plant if we water the plants and the water is like I, I like the water to drip out of the bottom of the plants because that way you're not over watering them ever because the water just drips out the bottom like the excess and this will still allow for that to happen which I think is fantastic so really excited about finding this uh, I believe this one retailed for $80 and uh, don't remember how much this cost at the store. I'll put it up here on the screen if I remember, but I just remember that this was at the Target store <laughs> and I was really excited that it was at the Goodwill. Um, and I don't know the retail price of the rug, but you know how rugs are usually pretty pricey. And then I have one more plant, let me go grab it. But, um, I almost forgot about this to show you guys. It is the most amazing hanging plant I've ever seen. The foliage is out of this world. And then it has these gorgeous flowers. Do you see that? They look almost like tiny little orchids. And this hangs and it's gorgeous and <sighs> I love it. It's so pretty. I have it over there um, on a little stand and it drapes over and cascades down. And it's just a dream. It's so, 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 so pretty. And I am completely obsessed. And now I'm going to have to hold it until the end of the video. Because I can't set it down because it's going to break the bottom of the, the leaves. But um... That's the end of the video. Thank you guys again so much for hanging out with me and checking out what I got. I have missed the thrift store so, so much and I'm so happy that I was able to check out the store 
went before it opened and um, that my friend was able to pick up some of the pieces for me. I know a lot of you guys went and I hope you guys had so much fun. A lot of you have been sending me messages about what you have found and I am just so excited for all of you. So if you guys ever find anything really cool at the thrift store, please tag me. Send me a message on Instagram because I want to see what you guys have found and I want to share it with the rest of you guys as well. So if you guys already don't follow me on Instagram, it's it's Hadrian, just like it's spelled here. Again, I'm going to be doing the little makeover of my patio within the next few days. So keep an eye out for that as well. I love you guys so much and I'll see you guys tomorrow bright and early for the new video at 7am. Till then, adios. Bye!